did a fly literally just fly by? That is so disrespectful. How did it get in my house? <laughs> that just ruined my whole mood. I hate flies. <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Kiki and you're watching Miss Kiki's Curls. So as you guys have already seen from the title, this is yet again another Zara haul. Surprise, surprise, surprise to no one. Some new in, this is some exciting stuff, but wait, there's a twist. This is actually a kids Zara haul. I went online, I went into the kids section and I purchased some items from the kids section. I am fairly petite, I'm five foot nothing. However, I'm not like super skinny or small, I'm more like average build with a little bit of curves. So this is a little scary. These clothes are made for children's bodies. My body is not a child body, like, body yaddy yaddy yaddy. <laughs> so, we are gonna put this to the test. I wanna see how these items fit. I have heard that if you are petite, sometimes you can get away with children's clothes. So I decided to give it a try. If you guys would like to see all of the Zara kids clothes that I purchased, <laughs> then let's go ahead and jump right in. All right guys, so this is the box. I just got so, wow, that was a great, great show in the box. I am so nervous because I feel like I got a whole bunch of Zara clothes and this could be a complete waste. Like I might have to return it all. I have no idea. I think I'll mention sizes, but I think for most of them, I did get the largest size, obviously, cause I'm not a kid. All right, so I'm just gonna grab stuff out, no particular order. This first item that I just looked at just terrified me because it is a purple sweatshirt, but I ordered it in a kid's 11 to 12. And I think for all of the other items, they're 13 to 14. So yeah. not sure about that, but I don't even remember ordering this. But this is just a standard uh, sweatshirt. It is a nice lilac color. Like I said, 11 to 12, a crew neck, basic, basic, basic. Um, it also looks a little short because it is kid size. This could be cute, like maybe give like a cropped look. I don't know, we'll have to try it on and see that is first item honestly don't know if that's gonna fit my body <laughs> not even gonna lie next item that i purchased are these ribbed kind of cream color pants or culottes these i did get in a size 13 to 14 and looking at them they are like a straight leg and then go into a flare um these are i believe supposed to be like more of like a culotte like shorter pant not like a full length pant but they might look kind of funny. So just looking at them, they do look like they could be a little bit see-through, which is scary, especially when I stretch these out with my hips and my butt. Not sure about that, um, but they are stretchy, elastic. Um, it looks like a normal waist, not, could be high-waisted, I don't know. Do kids wear high-waisted stuff nowadays? What's in style for kids? I have no idea. And then on the back, it does have this one little pocket. Super cute. Honestly, if I had a kid, they'd be wearing this. Like I mentioned, got this in a size 13 to 14. So we'll give that a try, see how it goes. I might have, I literally feel like this video could be a whole fail. Next item that I got is a cream colored sweatshirt. Uh, kind of like just a basic sweatshirt. This is in a 13 to 14. I feel like this is exactly the same as the purple one, um, but this does look like it'll fit a bit better uh, just because it's the bigger size. Um, nothing much to say, basic sweatshirt. Oh, forgot to mention the sweatshirts were $15.90 and the pants were $25.90. So definitely a price difference, which is awesome. I mean, if these work out, I can save a little money do some more hauls, you know, be able to afford that. Next item that I got are these purple uh, flared split hem pants. These are actually really cute. I kind of wish they weren't in this purple lavender color. I love this color, but y'all already know I'm a neutral queen, so it's hard for me to wear color. Um, I do a little better with loungewear, so it might be okay but I still struggle. But these are really cute. Um, um, these look like they could possibly be a little high-waisted. They have the seam running down the front, so a little bit more style. And then like I said, the split hem, it is the split hem to the front, which is really cute. I think in my last haul, I showed you guys a pair of black trousers. 
that were like that. And then these are ribbed, stretchy, super comfy. So I kind of like how this is a more casual take on the split hem, but also uh, still very stylish. And then these were $19.90 and I got a size 13 to 14. The next item that I got, I thought this was so, this is actually really big. What size is this? This is a 13 to 14. I actually feel like for this one, I could have gotten, what's the sizing, 11 to 12? the next size down. Um, but this is one of the shoulder padded tops. This is kind of like in a knitted material. This looks very, very similar to a women's item that I have in my closet that I think is actually smaller, um, but this is big. <laughs> so I guess it's supposed to be an oversized look. It's actually even longer, I think, than the item I have in my closet. And like I said, got this in a 13 to 14. Um, it was $29.90, so I'd say actually probably probably pretty comparable to pricing for a women's item but honestly if i saw a woman wearing this like you couldn't tell me that was from the kids section this is so cute i just realized though i have a top like this like if i had a kid they could have a top like this and we could be twinning oh can't wait well i can <laughs> i can wait <laughs> but um yeah so love that it is just sleeveless has the nice shoulder pads they're not super big, which I feel like sometimes the women's ones are a little excessive. So great, can't wait to try that on. And I think this was actually meant to be styled with the ribbed legging flare leg pants that I showed you guys. Alrighty guys, and then very last items that I purchased are once again, another one of these tops in this pink color, sleeveless, shoulder pads, long line, I might like this better since it's a bit longer. Um, and then the matching legging to go with it, same as the cream ones, ribbed, flared on the bottom. Like I said, I think it's supposed to be a bit of a shorter length, so they're not a full length pant. Has the cute little pocket in the back, and honestly, I think this might be my favorite set. So hopefully it will fit. We shall. So I just wanted to come on here real quickly to go ahead and show you my top pieces. Drum roll. Can you guys guess what I liked, what I didn't like? I definitely loved the two little like sleeveless sweatshirts. This style has been really in for the past, well, since last year, I think. Um, but I really liked the cream one and the pink one. They fit, honestly just like a regular women's top. So that is freaking amazing. The material is super soft. Um, they're priced at $29.90, which is a little bit pricey in my opinion, but I do feel like they are worth it. They are beautiful. They are like a thicker rib knit material. So more than likely, I'm not gonna hang on to them just because it's warming up and I live in the desert. I might let them go, um, but they are definitely top picks. Would keep them, couldn't even tell that they're kids highly recommend them and the colors are beautiful and then my very very top favorite piece out of this whole entire haul can you guess what it is can you guess can you guess i don't know if you can ba -ba -ra! but it is these lavender trousers leggings pants split leg whatever these are freaking amazing the only thing that is making it difficult for me to keep these is the color like where am I gonna wear purple pants to? I guess I could wear them just as lounge pants, which would be cool, but I am absolutely in love. So these are in that ribbed material. They have the front split hem, which is so cute and stylish. And honestly, these fit like a dream. They're actually high-waisted, <laughs> which is amazing because the other ones are on my, they're on the list not the good list. They have the seam running down the front. They have the lovely split seam that I'm obsessed with. The length is perfect. Like they are not too long for me. They're not too short for me. They fit me just right. And I mean, honestly, they're perfect except for the color. So they are my favorite. You guys have already probably seen in the try on clip. They're super cute. Love them. And honestly, if they came in like another color or more neutral color, I would probably keep them. I'm still kind of debating. Let me know what you guys think down below. And then the things I didn't like were the two like cool lot legging pant thingies. I just felt like the material was way too thin. They're like just a regular waist, which maybe even a little low rise. That's just not the vibe we're going for ever anymore in life, hopefully, at least for me, because 
does not suit me. A little pocket on the back. I don't know. I just didn't think they were flattering at all. And they look kiddish to me. They give me kiddish vibes. So those are out. And these sweatshirts, they're like, okay, but they're just basic sweatshirts. That's only the 13, 14. I think that's the size this, size this is. Fits a lot better. Um, the one that I accidentally got a size smaller, I think the purple one, way too tiny, unless you want something like a little cropped then okay, but the sleeves were hella short. So yeah, wouldn't recommend those as far as having like a woman body type. Honestly, I was surprised at how many items I actually ended up liking. And I was surprised that the items were not actually as bad as I thought that they would be. Like they kind of surprised me. So I might be interested in doing another Zara Kids haul. Let me know down below if you guys are interested in seeing something like that. And I can obviously do more different types of clothing. I do like dresses, jeans, more, you know, more fits, not just the loungy pieces and the stretchy pieces. I played it safe, but for you guys, I'm willing to take that risk. There is nothing else to say. We have made it to the end of this video. You guys will have seen the try on clips <laughs> while I've been talking about these items. So let me know down below which item or set or whatever was your favorite. Let me know if I should keep this stuff or return it. And let me know for sure if you want to see another Zara Kids haul, I can order more of an array of items so you guys can see how jeans fit, shoes fit, all that good if stuff. If you guys more. enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you share it. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already, because when the giveaway is up and running, you're going to have to be a subscriber to win, obviously. Also, thank you so much to all of my new subscribers. I really, really appreciate you guys. I have noticed. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. As always, take care, stay safe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Oh my gosh, maybe it's not a fly. What kind of bug is that? Shoot. I hate bugs. I lost my train of thought.